Hello everyone, GoBotch here, and we are back for our third season here with the Arkansas Razorbacks in college football revamp. The Razorbacks are starting our third season, number eight in the country, and taking on our first tough test. It's an SEC East opponent, the Georgia Bulldogs. They're number three in the nation, and uh, the Hogs are looking to have a, bit, a, a better finish than last year. Last year, we looked like we were going to be the number one team in the land, looked like we'd make it to the championship game and all that, but... Fortunately, fell flat and finished at the Peach Bowl against the Hurricanes. But today, we're getting started with this matchup. Let's go ahead and just show you all some of the recruits we're chasing after right now as we uh, get going. We're Jer Jermaine Archie, one of the big uh, number six overall quarterback, 83 potential overall. Where we've offered him, we're hoping, hopefully going to get him in. Uh, looking at receiving core, Wilson and Smith are two guys we're absolutely looking to get. Uh, Alex Jones and Hunt both are two tight ends that could potentially help us. Uh, and he's the number one tight end in the country, number one balanced tight end there. We're also trying to get Gullery here as a tackle. We're trying to get Cameron here as a guard. Um, Jones here as a center, which we absolutely need. A, that's a need for the team. Jenkins and Miller, defensive ends, potentially. Peterson and James here as uh, defensive tackles. And then at linebacker, we're looking to get three different backers here on the outside backer. Horn, Washington, and Rivas. And then Dunlap and Johnston over here at middle linebacker position. Taylor and Quinn are two targets we're looking at cornerback for the secondary depth. And then uh, we got a punter there we could potentially get. And then Cook, Slater, and Rankin here as athletes. So yeah, lots of good potential targets here for the Hogs to chase after and get. But y'all, we're here for this game. We're here for number three versus number eight. First game on our season. Let's get into the action again. If you enjoy, hit that thumbs up, comment below with your thoughts. And if we get 75 likes on this video, as soon as we pass that 75 like marker, I will upload the next episode of our college football revamp series. So hit that 75 goal and we'll get another episode up as soon as that's available. Okay. But yeah, it's raining on the opening game day today. Okay. I can deal. I can deal. Innovation that excites. So yeah, uh, there's your SEC West. You see Auburn's number four. We're number eight. Alabama 11. Ole Miss 23. And then in the East, you got number three, Georgia. Number nine, Florida. Number 21, South Carolina. And then the rest of the East. So yeah, uh, the SEC still is uh, quite dynamic, to say the least. So here we are from DW Reynolds Razorback Stadium. Traylon Smith and Brooks are our captains out there on the field. We are going to kick it off and let this defense get out there to get us started. So, so hopefully I'm not going to be too rusty. It has been a while since I've played. So we'll see how it goes. But again, house rules, so y'all do know, uh, we do not switch on defense. So once we eat the ball snap, we can't switch on defense. Uh, offensively, we, we, we kind of keep the same thing as well. We don't switch for passes and stuff of that nature. We've typically been a blitz first team. We're going to see how we're going to be this year. We're missing. We've got two new backers here that haven't started ever. So we're going to see how this goes here. Going with the blitz up the middle. He throws the ball away. JT Daniels first pass on the season, and it's incomplete. We'll take that. Um, second down now. Playing behind, you're probably going to be seeing a passing down here. We do have a really good front with Gregory and Nichols. We'll see how they play out for us this season. And bring pressure up the middle. And he's a slant. Hits Jackson. Jackson catches for the first pass and first time the chains move. Uh, Jackson, 16 yards. He beat Henry out there on the outside. Got to pay attention to that matchup. Come on, D. Come on, D. God, I'm getting my butt kicked right here. Yes, sir, you're there. JT Daniels sacked. He took off scrambling. And Jaron Handy was there for his first tackle. It's the sack of the season as well. Brings up a second and 12. A big time play there for the Hogs on defense. So we're going to play right here with Draper. Play back in coverage a little bit. And nothing's open downfield. He goes, and it's picked by Clark. Clark picks it. Big play for the Razorback defense as we force a turnover. JT Daniels took, took a big shot downfield, and Hudson Clark was there to make the big play as he looked like he was the primary receiver on that play more than anything. Way overthrown, and Clark read it. 
And that's a huge takeaway for the Hog defense. And now this offense that is set to have a hopefully a huge season head out into the field. Led from Justin Jefferson and Traylon Smith and company. Burks as well as always. Um, ooh, ooh. And there's Smith picking up 10 on his first carry on the year. So big play there for the Hogs to get started. Again, we're going to be seeing multiple running backs this year. And here is our freshman, number one recruit in the country, Kennedy, getting ready for his first carry on the season as a hog. And he will pick up six. Matt Kennedy out of the Woodlands, Texas. We're excited about him here in our Cardinal Red. I'm hoping he can be a huge asset for this team. And again, we are going to be paying attention to our, remember the last recruit we had that left, he uh, transferred out to... Akron, I believe, the Zips. Um, he was our backup running back that was a five-star recruit. We're going to keep an eye on him. I, I really want to follow him and see how he kind of does. Um, so we got a third and one here. Let's just go with another inside zone handoff. Burks, Rogers, and Knox are out wide. And Smith picks up three, gets the first down. We're going to go tempo now. We are a tempo-driven team. We're going to go tempo here. Um, let's go a little play action read pass here. We're going to see if Burks can beat that safety deep. Oh boy. I don't like any of it. Throw it away. Just throw it away. I don't like any of it. It freaked me out. The pressure got to me there on that play. So it's now second and ten. First pass of the day is an incompletion. Texas got beat by Notre Dame in the opening game of the season. Jefferson taking off, picks up 13 on his first scramble of the year. Picks up 13 for the Hogs. That's big time. That's what we do, my man. I'm sacked. Loss of 10. I kept, I kept floating backward in the pocket. That was a mistake I shouldn't have done. Uh, let's go with a deep pass. Second and long. Oh my gosh, they're everywhere. They're, we're getting our butt kicked right now up front. They are destroying us. Bama's, or sorry, not Bama, Clemson. They're a top 10 team, and they're uh, tra trailing in their game now as well. I mean, we, we're in a bad spot right now, guys. A terrible spot, matter of fact. Um, third and 28. We just need to try to get on the other side of the hog if we can. Two big sacks in a row, and now we're... Deep doo doo. Now he's scrambling. Let's try to pick come. up something. Let's try to pick up something. I mean, anything at that point. God bless. That was not a good drive to finish. Uh, Rhodes, our new punter, is out there. And he's. Wait, we need to change his helmet. Good lord, I can't look at that. Please be a good one. Give me a good hog bounce. No, he's going to return it. And Chavis. Wasn't able to get there. So Jack Saint with a return. So the defense, he took away the football. Um, but offense couldn't capitalize on it. We're going to bring a blitz on first time. This stupid gnat. Get out of my face. Driving me crazy. And they're going to run it. And they're going to bounce it out wide. And he is tackled. McIntosh with the run goes nowhere. Blair was there to set the play. And uh, second and 10 on the no game. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We're going to play off the edge here with Handy. It's a screen. It's a screen. Nowhere to go. I, I was just making sure he didn't pitch it off. I was making sure he just didn't want to pitch it off. It's fine by me. So a third down and long for the Bulldogs. We'll play right here with Parker. Oh, my gosh. So wide open. He overthrew him, though. Thank God you suck. Whew. Struggling and throwing in the rain is JT Daniels today. Incompletion, three and out. Hogs will get the ball back. Kennedy, the true freshman, back to return for the Razorbacks. Let's see if he can be a dynamic return man for us. Let's find out. First chance at it. And he's going to try to get an edge, and he couldn't quite get out there. Picked up nine. I think he'll be all right, though. I think he'll be all right. So first and ten for the Hogs. Um, let's try to get something started here with a little bit of a... We, we've been run, 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 run. Let's see if we can get something going here with the pass. Let's 
No. I mean, I'm just going to tell you right now, if this front's going to keep bulldozing through us, we're going to have to be doing a really quick patterns or something. Because right now, ain't nothing working for us in the pass protection at all. Nothing. Not what I'd like to see. Pick up a couple anyway. Pick up four. Dang. It's not what I want to be seeing. So, third down and a long six. AJ's first completion on the day now. Wide crowd here. And there's Goodwin with a catch. First down Hogs. Chris Goodwin in his sophomore year now here. Getting a chance to be a big-time player here for the Hogs. And I love to see it. I love to see it. It was his itchy. Turner, he transferred in here. Let's see how he can do here on this play. There he gets his first catch. Darren Turner. Darren Turner with a good catch there. Second and four now for the Razorbacks. So we're going to go with a little midline option here. A little midline option for KJ here. We're going to read this guy. And Traylon picks up eight. 235 and counting remaining here in the first quarter in a scoreless game between the Hogs and the Bulldogs. I couldn't quite get that edge right there. Big big number four came and chased my butt down. Good job here from him. Uh, second down now and six. Let's try strong flood out here. We need to find number 16, Traylon, or Trey Burks. Burks is going to be our top target, obviously. And caught. First and goal, 11 yards right there. Got a baby. I mean, he's a big target. You best believe he's going to have, hopefully, a huge year for the Razorbacks this year. He was our top target last year, obviously. Smith could try to put us in the end zone here and get us our first lead. And he will do so easily. Woo, woo pig. Hogs get into the end zone for the touchdown. And we are on top of Georgia. And there's the boot. It's up and through. 7 nothing Razorbacks. 51-14. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Clemson. A&M playing spoiler to number six Clemson. They drop. Wowza. A huge upset to get started. A&M already exceeding maybe expectations. Wowza. Wowza, wowza, wowza. So, uh, yeah, maybe the SEC is more loaded than everybody anticipates. I mean, normally we're already loaded enough as is, but that's a big win there for AM. That's a huge win. That's a win that could propel a program to have a huge season. Oh, my gosh. You got stiff armed into oblivion, sir. Oh, my gosh. You did too. I can't switch. Not allowed. 14 yards after two broken tackles, and uh, <laughs> that's not the type of play we want to be seeing right here, right? Screen potentially here. What we got going? Over the middle. That's my man. My bad. My bad. I left. I went into the flats. I should have stayed underneath. Uh, let's go with a little bullet double A, bring a blitz here. Maybe a terrible idea. And it was. And it was. There goes JT taking off down the sideline. Breaks one. Picks up the first 20-yard scramble from JT on the read option. And I was not ready for it. We went with the running back option. Pinch in, baby. Pinch in. Oh, my gosh. They did it again. And this time you're not going to get through everybody, sir. Not happening. Not in our house. Not in our house. So a second down and eight. Another option, and you're not getting that ball off. Big tackle on the outside there. That's a huge stop for the Hogs as Soli comes in and gets a second tackle. First for the loss, and that brings up a third down and 12 for the Dogs. That's a big play. That's a huge play. So the Hogs trying to pump this crowd up. Be loud Razorback Nation incomplete maybe another pick oh he couldn't pull it in but it's a stop nonetheless and that bring out the field goal crew now here 
Fourth and 12 field goal crew. They don't miss field goals very often in this game. We've knows that. And it's up, middle, and through. So it's 7-3 lead for the Razorbacks as they go through and they get a field goal. They get the ball back with 20 ticks left here in the opening quarter. Edel on back to return. Oh, good, good, good return back there down to the 20. Uh, six yard line, first and 10 hogs. We're going to get the ground rolling. Missouri dropped a game I just saw to uh, Memphis. Tennessee loses to UAB. Ooh. Some of those are losses I would not expect. Penn State got beat by Temple. How many top 25 teams will be beat in the opening week? Seems to be quite a few. So that's going to be it for the first quarter. Razorbacks on top, 7-3 to in what's been a pretty good game so far. Clark with a pick. Touchdown from Traylon Smith on the ground. And a field goal from Georgia. Here we go. All right, so here we are for quarter two. The Razorbacks on top here. Back at our own 29-yard line, 30-yard line. We're going to do a little read option here for KJ. See if we can get started with the ground game with him. Nope. Okay. It's fine. We're going to go here with Kennedy. Kennedy breaks up, gets to the 40-yard line for a 10-yard run. I'm, I'm telling you, he's going to be a big part of this offense. That one-two punch with him and uh, Smith is going to be borderline unstoppable, I think. Oh, my gosh. Throw it right there, my man. Give me a block right there. All right, Hudson with the catch. Picks up eight on that carry, on that reception, excuse me. Um, I kind of want to take a shot here with this. Let's go play action verts here. We're going to see if we can hit on the outside there on good one. In that safety here. See what they're going to do. He might not be able to get the pass off. Yes, I will. Yes, I will. Got the pass off perfectly. 26 yards on the day already for Hudson Henry on two receptions. First down. Whoopig. Eight first downs already on the half. Smith back in for the Hogs. Ooh, I like something I see right here. I like Knox on the outside there. I actually like Henry, though. Another reception for Henry over the middle of the field. Picking them apart. Eating up their lunch. I drink your milkshake. Drink it up. All right, here we go. Knox. Let's get in there, baby. KJ with his first rushing touchdown on the season. Again, big storyline heading into the season is how would his third year as a starter be? Again, first year he was a surprise product following in the footsteps of Felipe Franks after an injury. Um, came in and took the league by storm and was a Heisman candidate for much of the season. Second season didn't quite live up to the hype. Third year, though, is this the year where he takes it to another level? They cuts out the turnovers and has a propelling season for a Heisman candidacy run. We'll have to see. Uh, it's something to keep an eye on. Smith as well, though. Smith was in that conversation for a while as well. Oh, my gosh. Well, they didn't get anything on that. We took out the pitch, man. Draper with his first tackle and tackle for a loss on the year. We're going to go with the cover one lurker. This seem to be lurking. Screen, get through it. Help, 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 help. Come on, come on. Break down. Thank you. McIntosh gets six yards there. The third and five. Safeties get in right here. Let's go. And deep ball. He burned us. Pickens catches, gets the first down. He beat. Uh, was that Clark right there on that? to pick up the first down next time this defense will be playing on yeah, it was Clark on the outside right there he got burned dang it from the pass play leaves us with a first and ten and deflected nowhere let's bring a blitz here we're at our best when we make the quarterback uncomfortable in the pocket we all know it we're ready for an option here not gonna happen okay what about that huh it's Patrick catches, it gets four. The quarterback, JT, took a hit from linebacker right there. Third and six now. We're going to press, show blitz. Or not blitz him, but show blitz. 
Oh my gosh. Okay, good good stop. Burton picks up two. Fourth and four. We're going to hold them to the field goal opportunity still. So the Hogs, we're going to be playing right here. Make sure they're not doing anything crazy. And it's up. It's through. 14-6 is your score. 509 left here in the first half in the week one. And the Razorbacks so far looking pretty good. We're bending. We're not breaking very much here. Uh, Catalan set to return for the Hogs. Let's go. Pick up 27. It's kind of a weird route to take there on that. First and 10 now. Here we go. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastic. Trips right. Solo coverage there. We're going to run it all day, every day. Smith picking up six on this first carry of the drive. Let's go back to another run, shall we? Let's go back to another run. This offense is just so good. Oh, yeah. I need to start sliding more with KJ, too, as well. That's something I need to work on. I've been... We had some fumble issues last year, if y'all do remember. <laughs> um, we, need to, we need to cut those out if we can. He's on the run. Just get rid of it. I took a lick. I took a shot, but nothing was quite open for me downfield there. Um, let's go a little jet sweep here. See if we can catch y'all sleeping here. We're bringing Rodgers on the Jets. No, Burks. Perfect. Perfect. We need to get that block here, Kennedy, though. Burks picks up nine. I like what he can do, man. He's such a great player. He's going to be, I think, for sure, a first-round pick. Um, and real in real life as well, even in the game. One of the best receivers in the country. Third and one. Kennedy picking up four, five, six. Come on to get your fix. Let's go. Uh, first and ten. Let's go stick. Let's go stick here, see if we can get something. The offense going to try to open this field up, coming out in a five-wide set. And the defense counters with their dime look. Caught by Burks. Had to be patient on that one and just kind of see what I had. Uh, we got what we wanted. Let's go double cross here. Hurry up, Catalan. Get lined up. Oh. I tried to lob that over his head. I liked the route going behind him, but... Yeah, I, I wanted to lob that more than I did. My bad. It's all right. We're all right. Ill-advised pass. It happens. Again, I'm not going to be perfect this year. I do want to limit and minimize the turnover issues we've had with picks and fumbles. Not helping my case right there, clearly, but the season's young. Hopefully we can improve and not be as risky with those those types of passes like we just saw. That was ill-advised. Little screen. Pickens gets nothing. So a third and five upcoming for the gate for the Gators for Georgia. Um, third and five situation. Ball on the thirty-two. That's up. A wide open. Nobody's even in his zone. Shoot. That can't. That crap can't happen. Period. We can't let that stuff happen. Right, let's go, man. Let's bring some pressure here with the blitz. Get to the quarterback. And run. Breaks one. Gets four on that carry from McIntosh there. All right. Um, second and six. Over the middle. Good play there. Number 19. Who is that? Johnson? Way to lay out and make a play on the ball right there. I love it. You love to see that type of gritty defense getting after you, but going after him. I love it. Get to him. Get to him. Get to him. Or are you serious? Okay. You got hurt on the play, but good lord, what a play that was. I mean, he made it. 
Nice pass across his body and across the field. Made it happen. Gators rolling. Or, or Gators. Good Lord. Georgia. Keep wanting to call him the Gators. Uh oh. Over the middle. Caught. Breaks one. Pickens with another catch. 16 yards. First down. They got a little momentum rolling here on this drive. We need to suppress it. We've got to suppress this. Pre this uh, what we're seeing here. Get up in them. Come on. Pressure. 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 Pick it! No! You're right there! Blair, in and out of your hands, man. You're right there. That's a play you've got to make. That's a play that can come back and bite you in the butt if you don't take care of it. You know what I mean? Out route. Let's go! We got a foot down, Johnson. Let's go! Second takeaway of the game for this Hog defense. Second pick thrown from him. Car Johnson right there. Got a foot down. Oh, perfect. Perfection. Perfection. 151 left in the half. We get the ball to start the second half. Ooh. Okay. I got a little hot with that throw. I should have waited because uh, I, th I thought he was wide open. He was not. We got fortunate. We were very fortunate right there on that play. I'm going to do a little QB blast. Just go up the middle here. Pick up nine. Tempo. We got 132 left. We got to hurry. Clock stopped on what we're doing here. Oh, he was open too. I was trying to stand in there and throw a square on Burks on that slant deep. Um... Wasn't, wasn't great. Blaylock for uh, Georgia out for the game. Okay. Oh, broke on it. He broke on it. He broke on it. Not what I wanted. Should have waited on the read. Should have waited on the read. Dang it. Dang it. I'm ticked at myself for that. That was forcing another pass. I've got to stop that. I've got to stop that. It's not a good start to the season for our pick numbers. We can do better. We will do better. All right, we still got the lead, though. Man, self-inflicted stuff. Got to cut that out. So 120 left. Let's see if we can fix it. He's got one touchdown rushing and two picks thrown now. And they're both forced. They're both forced passes on my end. It was not... Ooh, give me that. Give me that. Oh, my goodness. A huge return from Kendall Catalan. Gets us down to the... Where are we at? 40... Where are we at? 43-yard line. So now... How do we bounce back? Again, the rest is showing, especially in the passing game for me. I'm not reading very well. I'm not reacting very well at all. Okay, good stuff there. There we go. Make up for the mistakes, Gobach, by making... For every bad mistake, make five or five to ten great plays. You know what I mean? Ten to sixteen passing is not terrible at all. Let's do a little play action here. Nope, not that. Let's go to the deep pass, actually. Go look at this. Rodgers is in man coverage out there. If he can beat that guy. We'll see. We're throwing it up to him. You let Stevenson get in front of you. You've got to... And I know that was a risky play. I probably shouldn't be making that type of a risky read. But... From the 20 -yard line, I thought we had the, the matchup we wanted on that, you know? I thought we had the matchup we wanted. Pick up a few. Keeps the clock rolling. Third and six. Let's go levels. What am I doing? Oh my goodness, what a play made from KJ on the ground. Just do it yourself on the ground with your legs. It's a miracle I got through that without something terrible, terrible, terrible happening. 35 seconds left now. We're looking at Rodgers on this little drag route. 
No, I'm not. Okay. Tempo, please. Just hurry up. I'm not going to call a timeout yet. Come on, go botch. I'm a little bit flustered by my picks. I'm scared to throw deep now because of those picks, to be honest with you. But I'm not scared to throw it there. Let's go. Get one back. Get one back. Let's go. Big play. Made to Henry. Let's go, baby. And kicks up and through. So 14 ticks left here in the half. Uh, Bama's on top of South Carolina, 24 to 10, as Young has three touchdowns through the air. So 14 seconds left. I don't foresee them doing anything here. They're probably just going to run it, take a knee, get out of here. And uh, solid game overall. And Jackson has one catch for 16 yards total. So let's see what they're going to do here. Uh, I, again, I don't see them probably wanting to do much of anything. Maybe they will. Timeout called. They like that enough, apparently. So let's go with the zone. Let's see what they're going to do here. And be able to try to make the adjustment over the middle played bobble ball right there and he caught it looked like it was deflected away so yeah they're not gonna get definitely not gonna be able to get it here um see if this defense can maybe get a takeaway get a third takeaway we're fortunate they burned us but it's halftime. We're up 21 to 12, despite our two picks we've thrown. Um, we're, we're, we're winning this game, and we're the better team thus far. Let's see if we can settle that into the second half. Here we are, second half, 21 12 is your score. Let's get it going. Catalan to return. We just need to settle down. No more, no more interceptions, go botch. No more stupid little picks, right? No more stupid picks, preferably. Let's get it. Let's get it started with the ground game. Kennedy taking off at the middle, picks up a first down there with relative ease. You'll love to see it. What is happening? Holy crap! Let's go right here. All right, let's go here with Kennedy again. Pick up a big gain. 19 on the ground right there for Kennedy. He's having a good day today. Six, 56 yards on six rushes for the freshman. He's really having a solid game. I'm very impressed with him. Very impressed with him. So Burks... Caught by Knox. That was kind of an awkward animation, but we'll take it. Picked up 17 on that play. With a little bit of a read option here. 12 of 19 passing for KJ today to get going. Couldn't quite get as much as I was liking on that right there. We, we picked up six. Hmm. Let's go run to the open side of the field here. KJ to Smith now. Everybody's almost on fire. And he picks up a couple, picks up five first down, new set of downs for the Hogs. Um, let's try to catch y'all sleeping on a screen pass. We haven't done one of these yet. And we got what we needed. Oh, we almost slipped through that, man. All right, we'll let some people get breaks now. Let's go with a little bit of a draw. Smith checking back in for the Razorbacks. Can I get through my own line? I was like trying to, trying to find my way through. It was like trying to navigate a maze, and I, I would win in that battle. Third and two now. Smith has nine for forty-three yards. Oh boy. It's stuffed. Stuffed. I'm going for it though. I'm going for it. I'm going for it. Playing it risky. 
defense is still on the field. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. KJ picks up the first new set of downs. First and goal for the Razorbacks now. We got a little bit of a three-headed monster out here with our running game. Between Kennedy, Smith, and KJ, we've got weapons, man. Oh, I threw it at square, but too late. Tried. I tried to get him in there. Let's go with the screen pass in the middle here. Wide receiver screen looking at Knox on this. Haven't run this one yet. Caught. Oh, if he could have turned up and just stretched across right there. Just stretch that hand across for the touchdown. It would have been perfect. Now, third and goal. 14 of 22 passing. 182 yards to the air. One touchdown, two picks. Walk it in, fella. Walk it in. Second touchdown rushing on the day. Three total from him on the ground. Or on the ground through the air together. Um, that's what we need to see. One for two here. We're looking at Smith on this. Got it, baby. Let's go. Let's go. 29-12 lead. 4.58 left here in the third. And the Razorbacks, offensively, if we don't turn over the football, we're pretty dang hard to stop. Uh, period. Period. Defensively, we, we don't break too often. Here comes our defense. We have a two picks. We have a sack. Uh, we're averaging seven yards. Per drive is that right or no it's per drive per game per carry or whatever we'll see uh, 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 uh. get after him pick that oh man dude. where'd you fading off to where are you going on that that should have been a he should have jumped that route and had a pick easy peasy and you know they got to be trying to get pickens and jackson going Oh, deflected. Good hands. Good hands right there. Way to get your hands up on that. Deflect the football. Third down and five. Three of six on third downs today. 50% uh, rating. Let's see if we can stop him here. And incomplete. Threw it behind him. I guess he kind of panicked on that pressure. Brooks was coming downhill right there. That's a three and out. The Razorback defense does her job yet again. So we'll get the ball back here with a chance to add on to the lead. Kennedy to return. There's the boot, Kennedy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Cross midfield. Well done. I'm, I'm liking him. I'm liking Kennedy. I don't know how good of a receiving back he is yet. Haven't seen that numbers, but uh, I think he's special. I think he's going to be a really good one-two punch this year. And then, ooh, let's go play action, my man. They're bunched up on us here. Ooh, my bad. I forced another pass. I I, I told y'all I wasn't going to do that anymore, didn't I? <laughs> Oops. Stakes were made. Stakes were made. Down, quiet, quiet crowd now. They realize how lucky we were not to turn over the football right there on that. Just go. You just go, Henry. Caught by Burks. Five-yard pickup. How many catches does he have now today? Three for 29. That's it. I haven't been able to really get him going. I've struggled to get him going today. Um, Not liking a lot of what I'm seeing right now. Let's go slants. I got hit. I, I lived to see another down is what I was doing there. I didn't have what I wanted open. And I know I'm fading out of the pocket. I, I've seen these comments before from my community, but you know what? It's okay. We'll live another day. We'll live to see another another play. Oh, my gosh. Give me a good bounce. No. All right. So today there's the score. There's the plays. We've We've... 20 more plays in them. Um, 
We just gotta capitalize on some situations a little bit better than we have today. These two picks have really cost us. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Gizmo's barking. Good lord, chill out. And a hard run there after catch. Apologize for my dog in the background. There's Gizmo going bananas. Gizmo, shut up. It's first down. First down. For pressure. Oh, actually, back up. Back up that pressure. Don't trust it. And he completed it. And what are you doing right there, Catalan? You're just 99 overall secondary player, and you did jack crap for me right there to help out. God bless. Come on. God, we're getting burned downfield now. So, first and ten. Another completion downfield. We're just going to go zone, I guess. Let's go sink into a cover three. Let's just try to make him throw it deep and maybe get a pick. Right? God bless. Shut up, Gizmo. He's annoying the crap out of me. Annoying the crap out of me. So second and 11, they got momentum going on offense. And they go the option. JT Daniel, nowhere to go, baby. Nowhere to go. Runs right into Torian Carter with his first tackle for the game. And it brings up a huge down. Third and 16. They need to get in the end zone. We just need to force them to kick a field goal or, you know, something of the like. So here we go. Third and 16. Get him. Oh my gosh. Pick from Clark is second of the game. And we get it. Third takeaway of the game. Third pick from the secondary today. Second from Clark. It was a jump ball to the end zone. And we take advantage of that ill-advised play. Get the ball. With our heels on the goal line practically though here. Gotta be careful. Gotta be careful. Smith's gonna give us a little bit more wiggle room to breathe. That's a huge play. It's a huge, huge pick, man. This defense is showing up today. We're, we're forcing take. We're getting takeaways. That's huge. Kennedy now. Uh, got close. He got it. Okay, let's go tempo with him. Kennedy's seventh rush for 57 yards on the day. Um, he's been fun to watch, man. Oh man, got me right there. Second and eight now. Let's go with the setup play here. Gonna go with the inverted uh, little option here with Kennedy. We're reading this outside guy, see what he does. Oh, rumbling and fumbling around. Third and three now. Let's go, curls. It's a big down. No! I thought he was staying underneath. And yes, I am going to bring on the punt team because I'm too scared to go for it now. I should have ran it and just made it a no matter what situation. Boot it. Towards the sideline. Chavis chasing. So, yeah, as bad as we've been throwing the football at times today, JT's been worse, thank God. 33 seconds left here in the third. Can we force another takeaway, potentially? And they go simple out route to Pickens. That's what he needs to be doing, just doing the simple little check down plays like that. He's been far more successful in doing that than he has been trying to take shots downfield. That's for certain. Got him. Third and inches. Third and inches. Maybe time for one more play before the quarter ends. Let's see what they're going to do here. Are they going to hurry up to the line and get a snap off? Or are they going to take this thing into the locker room? Or to the sideline? And we're going to go to the fourth. 29-12 is your score here in week one. The Hogs lead Georgia. 
And it's been a it's been a fun game. It's been a good one. Let's see if we can finish it. All right, fourth and final quarter. It's third and inches here for Georgia. And I'm halfway expecting them to run it. I really do. I'm going to go the blitz here. Expect the run. They got the run. They got huge ga huge gain from Milton. That's the best rush they've had in a, a while, it seems like to me. Uh, so first and 10, who set it downs? 14 first down of the day now for them. Empty backfield as well. Oh, boy. Get out of that. It goes on. Underneath, caught, breaking everything. Arian Smith with their first down reception there. We've been here before. Let's just not let them get a field goal. Or not let them get a touchdown. Excuse me. Field goal I can live with. Touchdowns, no dice. Oh, I went, didn't I? Nope. No flag. Oh, good play there from Brooks. Way to get in front of that. It's fourth. Tackle is one deflection out right there. They're almost, they've almost caught up to us in yards, total yards. Oh, screen pass. Get there. They got the blocks they needed. First down and go goal. First and goal now. Perfect screen pass call on that play right there. And now here we go. First and goal. One of the rare times they've been in the red zone today. Up the middle, running, picks up four. Let's just go man coverage, man coverage. Read option, take it to them. Yep, perfect call. They went with the inverted read option on that, and he took it to the house. Or it was a midline option, one of the two. Um, and they're going to get this back inside two possessions to make it a 29-19 game. So it's still two possession lead nonetheless. A touchdown here could probably seal the deal in this game, in my opinion. Uh, that was a good job. Good drive there from them. South Car North, uh, NC State gets a win. We see them next week. And good return there from Kendall Catalan. 37 yards. First and 10 hogs. 6.43 left, and we are going to start to go clock burn mode. So let's go to the adjustments. Tempo, conservative. Uh, let's get that clock to scrape down a little bit. Let's try to chew the clock a little bit here. Smith return, or, or, or running here for me. Smith picks up four, five. Okay. Second down. His 12th rush, 57 yards on the day out there for number 22, Traylon Smith. South Carolina and Bama having a good game out there, but it looks like Bama got to pull away with that one. Tried to cut back right there. It didn't quite work. Third and three now. All right, so now this is where we get in a tricky spot. We need to decide. Do we want to go with another one up the middle, make it a four-down territory type deal? And I think that's going to be the call. I'm going to go four-down territory and just run it and see what we can pick up here. And, oh, my God, stiff arm. We're going for it. Uh, we're going for it. I got kind of smoked right there. Same exact play. Perfectly done. Perfectly executed. First down and 10. All right, so we got the first down. Um, let's go base left. Smith's still in the game for the Hogs. Okay, picked up four. All right, so first or second and six now. Let's go. Let's go zone here. Zone split. Smith still gonna get another run here. Good run from Smith, picking up twelve on the first. Eighty-one yards now for Smith. Let's go back to a, another dive. And Kennedy coming in the game now for the Razorbacks. You can keep running that ball. Gonna take that clock down, down, down. And Kennedy gets ganged up. <laughs> he gets ganged up on. Um, whoops, I did not mean to do that. Okay. Let's go another dive up the middle here.
Picking up a few, picks up five. So third down and three now for the Razorbacks. Um, they don't want me to pass. We're gonna do a little option. We're gonna do a little option here on this. Less than three minutes in the game. And they get nice yardage on that run. 209 yards of all-purpose running today from the Hogs. Um, it's worked perfectly. To perfection. Tenth play of the drive now for the Razorbacks. Smith. Our game plan has worked perfectly on this drive. Smith, the ball carrier. Oh, shoestring tackle. First time out there called from the Bulldogs. And I'll bring up a second and five now. We're going to just keep, keep, keep going on the ground. Bama did pull off the win against South Carolina. Their second time out called from Georgia. Okay. So that's uh, Bama's first win under their new head coach. The Saban era has ended. Iowa State's former head coach that won the national championship last season. Now the new head coach there in Tuscaloosa. And, of course, he comes in and leads them to a win against a ranked opponent. So no timeouts left. Um, no timeouts left now. We're going to get that clock started to roll. Maybe put the ball in the end zone another time would be nice. He pushing forward. Picked up three. Picked up three. 20 rushes on the day for Smith. Let's go sweep. That's been all runs, too. We haven't done a single pass play on this whole drive. Second on the day for Traylon. In the end zone for the Hogs. With a minute 16 left. And a little exclamation point to add on to this against this Georgia defense. <laughs> we'll take it. Studio update. What do we got? There's the final. So Young was solid. Four rushing or four uh, passing touchdowns. Billingsley, the tight end, 100 yards, two receiving touchdowns. And McLennan, McClellan, excuse me, 100 yards rushing for the touchdown. Good Lord. Huge game there for the Crimson Tide. Minute 16 left here on this one, and it's pretty much all and over. Uh, we just need to get get to the final whistle. And we know what they're going to do. They're going to start taking some looks downfield. Um, let's see if we can get another pick. Bada boy. Get to him. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Sit down, sir. Sit it down. Are they going to spike it? Okay, third down and 17, whatever. Doesn't phase me one bit. <laughs> so third and 17 for Georgia. Oh, my gosh. Get absolutely wrecked. JT Daniel takes another one. That's going to be... That's going to be it for them. We're going to take a punt here from Kennedy and then uh, take a knee and get out of this one here with a win. Big, big game here from the Razorbacks, especially rushing the football. Over 200 yards all-purpose rushing from three different top targets. Uh, Kennedy gets seven. He was included in that number today. And, uh, yeah, that's going to that's gonna do it. Let's send this thing out, man. Ball game. And the, the Woo Pig Suey continues on here. Jefferson leads the Hogs to win. Had two picks. Wasn't the greatest, but uh, all purpose right there. 187 yards. Passing 55 rushing with, what, three all purpose touchdowns? And uh, we'll take that dub. We'll take that big win. Beat a top three team at home. 36 to 19, your final. And uh, KJ, a little bit all over the place today, but it didn't matter because we finished with the victory today is exactly what the doctor ordered so let's see let's get to the stats for today's game as we look at some of the screens here um yeah we we, we did a pretty good job of minimizing minimizing the uh offensive output from jt daniel and company he kind of got going later in the game but for the most part he wasn't really able to get comfortable out there in the pocket or anything and it led to a lot of issues so let's look at some of the stats for today's game for the Hogs, KJ, 15 of 26, 187 yards passing, the touchdown, two picks. Not the greatest passing day from him, rushing 
Uh, he had 55 with two rushing touchdowns. Smith, 97 t- uh, yards with two touchdowns. And then Kennedy in his debut, 10 uh, rushes, 66 yards, no touchdowns. But uh, showing that he's definitely got some pop in him right there. Top receiver was Henry, 4 for 70 with a touchdown. Burks, 3 for 29. And then so on and so forth. We shared it around pretty well today. Defensively top tackler out there on the day was uh, Catalan at 5. Uh, top tackle for loss is Handy. We had two sacks from Handy as well. Two picks from Gregory or from, from Clark and one from Johnson. And the Hogs pull out the win in week one at home against Georgia. All right, there you have it. Big win for the Hogs and our opener. Um, we'll take it. We will move on to week two as we're getting ready to play another top 25 team at NC at home against NC State. Um, yeah, Georgia. In the rain, maybe that was the great equalizer for us today because JT was not as good as I was expecting him to be through the air. He was minimal in uh, his deep efforts against us and really struggled. And that helped us a lot because three picks was the big was the big change, I think, in that game for us today. So moving on, getting ready for NC State, the Wolfpack, and um, hopefully they, they got a win. Uh, we're now number five after our win against the top three team. We moved from eight to five. So... Uh, are we picked to win this game? We better be. We better be picked to win. Yeah, we are, Corso. That's right. Yeah, we are. So let's go ahead and move over here. Let's look at some of the top stories here. Again, Clemson moved from 6 down to 14, and AM goes from unranked into 21st in the country now after their win. Um, Texas, after their loss, drops out of the top 10 as Notre Dame gets in the top 25 now at number 22. Uh, Bama moves into the top 10 now at number 9 in the country and so forth so uh yeah some uh some big some big games there number one still ohio state they haven't played top three have not played yet michigan with their win moves up to number four we move up to five oklahoma to six florida seven uh, usc at eight and alabama nine georgia moves from three down to ten uh moving at looking at the rest of the country um some new faces in here some teams didn't play some did but yeah not bad overall let's let's look down here and see through week one, is there any new changes in the Heisman race? The left outside linebacker, who had an interception, a forced fumble, two sacks, four tackles, and four tackles for loss. He moved into the Heisman race. How about that? Good for him. Uh, really quickly, I do want to look at some stats. I want to see if that kid played for Akron, the Zips. Thankfully, they're right there. Uh, where is he? Are they not the Zips? Thinking about somebody else? Where is he? Was it not Akron? Maybe I'm thinking about a different team. Thought they were the Zips, right? Maybe he's not playing there. I don't know. We'll have to figure out where where he went into and whatnot. I'm pretty sure that was right though, the Akron Zips. But I guess he's not playing there yet, as uh, he he's not showing up on the thing. So yeah, that's gonna do it for today's episode, y'all. The Hogs pick up the big win next episode at. If we hit 75 likes on today's video, when we hit that 75 mark, I'll get this next episode uploaded. So the sooner, the better. Uh, number 12, NC State is awaiting the Hogs in week two. But that's going to do it. Comment below with your thoughts. Stay tuned for more. Thank you so much for tuning in. Stay safe and God bless. And we'll see you back here in the next one. You'll take it easy.